kids come back every year, and I get to watch them grow and grow and grow. And the same case with Aiden and Andrew. Good morning, welcome. Good morning. <laughs> Tell us, give us a brief story for those who uh, don't know the story before. Um, I had a high-risk pregnancy. Um, they thought that they were um, transfusion, you know, transfusion syndrome to where one baby takes over all the nutrition and the other baby dies off, which wasn't their case. Um, unfortunately, they were born early, 27 weeks. Um, so at Akron Children's for three and a half to four months. They ended up staying here at Bigley for maybe about a couple weeks. Um, came home, they've been doing great, you know, have asthma, which is, you know, okay. We deal with, you know, any sickness or illness or whatever, but it'll be three in October. They're doing wonderful. <laughs> now tell me, they're, they're twins, so tell me how they're different. Oh, they both have different, you know, attitudes. One's, you know, stubborn, the other one's like, yeah, whatever, you know, whatever happens, <laughs> happens. <laughs> Who's like mom, the stubborn one or the whatever? Whatever. <laughs> whatever. Okay, I got that. Uh, tell me about since they spent so much time here, what it is to be a part of the Akron Children's Hospital family. How they treat you and how you, you're brought into They're, everything. They treat us like family, you know. They're doing speech right now, which, you know, Jeannie, she's just a wonderful lady. <laughs> It's, it's fun to see the kids interact with the doctors and the nurses here. It's, it's like they're their own kids when they're here oh, on yeah. the floor. Oh, yeah. As soon as she walks out that door, they go run into the door. They just love her. <laughs> so you, you can recommend Akron Children's Hospital to anybody with, with kids that need have problems. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, I see kids coming in and out, and I'm like thinking, you know, you, you chose the right place. Because you never know. Right, exactly. <laughs> well, it looks like they're thriving. They're doing a great job. Oh yeah, they are. And, mom and, and grandparents in the back. They're sitting. They're sitting there. They came in to help you out. And no, like you said, there's no no stroller this year. No, no stroller. I mean, we do still do stroller once in a while. You know, if we go places, but I can't handle them running through the you know clothes at a you know store or whatever. If I had a chance to ride in a stroller versus walking, no, I might do I that too. The, I choose the stroller too. I hear you. Well, thank you for coming in. Thank you so much. Great story. It's all.